recording. Okay, mission nine. Uh, this is the safe route uh, version where we would have two engineers and the commando first. Um, this level plays out the exact same regardless of the route again. It's just uh, going to be slightly different starting positions. Um, so uh, let's get straight into it. Uh, we, we don't want, by the way, we don't want our sapper first. We want one of the engineers first um, because that will uh, be our, mean our engineer is closest to collecting the airstrike. Our first move is to walk forwards until the edge of a crater. Uh, equip the jetpack uh, and jetpack directly onto the cliff. Uh, lots of that cliff is walkable, so we don't have to worry about the slipperiness. Um, and the other thing with the cliff, we're jetpacking to the cliff and our jetpack will fall down below the cliff, hopefully. Uh, just, yeah, it, it, it's, it's fairly safe that you can get close to the cliff without damaging yourself with the jetpack. Um, so yeah, tap and tap, start, equip, get to this crater. Um, you want to turn slightly forwards and slightly left. There was a bit of lag, which almost made me get hit, but it's, it's fairly safe. Uh, then you want to put a TNT. If you're going for the fastest possible, you're just going to walk down here, place the TNT. But instead, uh, just for safety, I'm going to turn around and make sure I'm pointing this guy towards that other tent. I want this guy to not end up too close to that tent, um, which I'll explain in a moment. Uh, I'm just going to walk up here, get close to this guy so he'll pistol us down. Uh, see, that wasn't too close to the tent, which is perfect. If you end up putting the guy essentially in the tent, uh, there's a chance they'll be completely obliterated which you may think is good, and most of the time it is, but in this level it's bad because that obliteration moves all of the other pigs away from this airstrike. So we're an engineer, we're gonna jump, uh, we're gonna get the airstrike. Now, this shot, as I set a safe state, is, is really easy to set up. You want the, f the tail of this airstrike to be halfway between uh, those two pigs and you want the guy on top of the mound to be anywhere within this like triangular window it would be successful uh, I'm saying this live but this should be successful as far as I've tested um, I can try the other points as well the only thing to worry about with this is if you push this guy too close to the bridge he'll blow it up and you'll waste time everyone is dead uh, I did not set a save state apparently. Okay, now that I've set up the save state, uh, I can show this airstrike from lots of different positions. So Bobby Jim is in a slightly different position than before, but the critical thing is Bobby Joe has to be anywhere within our triangular window. So we tried one side and now we're going to try the other extreme. Uh, we can speed this up and everyone should be dead, hopefully. You're dead and you're dead. Uh, yep, yeah, so we can try to slightly to this side now. Um, Yep, the same result, uh, and to that extreme. Um, so you don't have to be too precise with this airstrike. As I say, the only thing that can go wrong is if Bobby Jim uh, completely obliterates because it pushes the guy on top of the mound to a, a safe space where he's not going to get hit by the airstrike as much. Um, this, yeah, there are other alternatives to this, uh, which was in my last 
full run of any percent where you can blow up the bridge to get the super TNT, but I now believe this to be slower and I wouldn't do that route. Um, so now I'm just going to show the alternative route. Right, uh, this is route two setup, so we can't promote still. Uh, we'll be able to promote in the next island, but for this, it's just our commando first, uh, then our three sappers. Um, so our commando starts in the same position, which is very fortunate. Uh, same thing. And the only thing that's going to change is our sapper has less health to jump across to that island with. Um, and it's going to start in a slightly different position. Um, so yeah, here, then bait the pistol shot to get the hit down the slope. That's fine again. So I think we're oh, okay with three away. So we have to walk a bit further, I think, but it's not that much of a big deal. Uh, the 20 less health means we, I think you have to be very careful to get that jump. Uh, because yeah, we're, we're ending on low health. <laughs> so if you mess up the jump, you might struggle to get across. Um, I should have done that quicker because it's not precise. He says, hoping that it just actually works. But yeah, everyone's dead again. It's getting close to that bridge. Uh, it would just waste a few extra seconds. But this mission is fairly straightforward, which is great because, um, yeah, having all of the the RNG in the first level and then having like the rest of the game, uh, rest of this island be really easy is very fortunate for us. Uh, but that's it for this mission.